Hello and welcome to Boring Dad Gaming, where today we're going to be taking a look at Card Shark, and uh, we're going to run a little how-to series in that we're going to, I'm going to run through how you perform each of the manoeuvres. There's 28 in all um, in Card Shark, so we're going to learn one by one how to do each of them and, you know, eventually win the game. Uh, so today we're going to be taking a look at the very first trick you learn. This is uh, some, in some ways a, a tutorial, so it's the easiest trick in the game. Um, it's called the Bottle of Cahors, and, and yeah, we're going to learn how to, how we do it. So, the aim of this trick is to peek at another player's cards, and we need to communicate uh, what we see to the Comte, who is the guy who's sitting at the table and is going to be cheating. So, he's saying that we're going to be serving wine as we play and peek at the opponent's cards. And then we're going to signal to him which is the best suit in the hand. So we're looking for the best suit. So in this hand that we're peeking over at, at the moment, we can see that the best card in the hand is the Ace of Diamonds. And the way we're going to be doing this signal is we're going to be wiping our cloth on the table in particular patterns. And we're going to learn these patterns uh, one by one. And we're going to run through those now. So for hearts, we're going to be wiping in a clockwise motion. So if you imagine what a clock looks like and the way the hands move around the clock, that's the direction we're going. So you sort of start at the top and we go all the way around in a circle to signal hearts. And you do have a little indicator there on the left that shows to you that you're you know, performing the right operation. And here, for spades, we're going to do the exact opposite. We're going to go around in a counterclockwise direction. Do it slowly so you can see we go around in a circle counterclockwise. Right, now for diamonds, we want to go up and down, so straight up, straight down. So for each of these, remember, we're holding the mouse button down. So straight up, straight down, we're holding the mouse button. We can see on the left that that's a diamond. And then clubs, we are going to go left to right, so the opposite again. And we can see there that it knows that we're doing the right pattern for clubs. Now we're going to move on to the next part of the trick, and then we'll put it all together and just show him that we're able to do it. So we're going to try and peek, peek over his shoulder as we pour a drink, and it's actually, I saw in the text there that we were actually looking for the, the most cards of a suit in his hand, not the highest card, we're looking for the most uh, of a, one suit. So you pour, again, by holding down the left mouse button and dragging it from uh, left to right, and you want to sort of do this fairly slowly, because um, we want enough time to see what, what he's got there. So he's got three spades, we can see, so that's, spades is what we're looking for. So remember, for spades, we need to go click down the left mouse, left mouse button and go around in a counter-clockwise direction, like so. We're going to do that again, just so we make sure that we've got it. So we're going to pour the wine slowly enough that we can see which cards he's got. So he's got three hearts in his hand, so hearts is the signal we're looking for this time. And as before, we're going to hold down the left mouse button, and for hearts, we know that we go in a clockwise direction, like so. And then we fit. So there we go. We've learned how to do the bottle of Cahors, the first trick in Card Shark. And uh, when we come back next time, we'll learn how to do the second trick. I hope you join me then. <laughs>